Hey everyone, welcome to group break number 322. Today we have an eight box inner case of 2020, 2021, uh, upper deck OPG Platinum Hobby. This has been a while since uh, we've opened this up. So uh, really looking forward to this break. I Again, OPG Platinum is just kind of a fun product. Lots of good value because you got all your base rookies in there. Um, yeah, so anyways, without further ado, let's get into the team names and random. So three times on the names, three times on the teams, who you line up with is who you get. Uh, T class, uh, marquee like, uh, marquee rookies are their rookie cards, so they ship. Um, the only thing that doesn't ship is like the veteran base, essentially. So like, you know, your base like, Pedersons, McDavid, stuff like that. Any parallel, everything obviously ships, but like rookies ship for sure. Um, there will never be a break where we don't ship the rookies because they're what's honestly the most valuable stuff in products. So, all right, here we go. Uh, three times on the names, three times on the teams. Who you line up with is who you get. Good luck, everyone. Got a click your mouse today. Same my uh. Whoop, there we go. My uh. Old mouse, the sensor has been going in it. So. Here we go. Three times. Once. Twice. Third time. So it might be a little bit shaky, but. Should be fine. Just if there are any misclicks, it is a different size and shape. A little bit lighter. Here we go. Three times on the teams. Good luck. Once. Twice. Third time. Kings on top. Penguins on the bottom. Wild are probably the team that you want to have in this break. I mean, Rangers are also really good. You got a lot of value there. So, here we go. Good luck, everyone. Uh, Glenn, you've got the Kings. Jason with the Jets. Christian with the Red Wings. Joseph with the Vegas Golden Knights. Terry with the Capitals. Scott with the Oilers. Raymond with the Bruins. Chris with the Canucks. Emil with the Senators. Brent, you've got the Islanders. Jordan with the Chicago Blackhawks. Clayton with the Panthers. Brandon, you got the Abs. Steve with the Flames. Christian with the Lightning. Uh, Emil with the Wild, Bill with the Hurricanes, Dan with the Leafs, uh, Brandon, you've got the Columbus Blue Jackets, Graham with the Devils, Mark Meckelberg with the Philadelphia Flyers, Mark Vandersaren, you got the Rangers, Marshall with the Blues, Brandon with the Sharks and Habs, Colin with the Ducks, uh, Andrew with the Coyotes, Mark with the, that's Mark Vandersaren with the Stars, uh, that's also a good team, uh, Riley with the Sabres, Scott with the Predators and Penguins. Uh, another sleeper team is actually Vegas in this break. Uh, if I remember correctly, Vegas is really, really solid. So I'll get them into the team viewer here. Again, obviously no Seattle Kraken because they weren't in the league when this product is printed, so we don't have to worry about those cards. Uh, yeah. Should be a fun break. Brandon, you had three spots kind of in right in the middle of the... Uh, Thing. Final team view live. Yeah, Ottawa is good too. There's honestly like, a, there's the thing with Platinum is that like, there's a lot of like decent teams just because there's value in the base rookies. And then like, you know, I think the Avs, they'll have Byram. So like, that's good. Um, I want to say there's like Makar rookie or no, it's Quinn Hughes. I think that has the rookie updates. Yeah, it's Hughes for the Canucks with the rookie updates. Um, but yeah, yeah. Byram is your chase. Yeah. Like again, there's lots of good teams. Um, I mean, yeah, Vegas, you've got Krebs is like your highlighter. Um, I think Cal is Cali in this. I can't remember. I think so. I just had the checklist up, so hang on. sorry. I just got to turn on do not disturb on my watch because it's buzzing um i want to say cali have made it in but yeah i like the stars in this as well i think the stars are a solid team so yeah cali have did make it in i don't think um rathbone did though yeah because i remember pulling cali of stuff uh, I would, so like, and in terms of like pure quantity, like Vegas is legitimately one of the best teams in this break, I think. Um, 
Vegas has a lot of, like, stuff. Like, you're gonna... You should typically get stuff with Vegas. But, yeah, Minnesota's probably... Like, Kaprizov, top team. So. Here we go. Good luck, everyone. I need to really just start opening up the cases from the bottom again. Because it's so much easier. Uh, yeah, you've got you've got him. I don't know if Belzeal and Evans are both in it as well. Because they were both there. But, yeah. I would say the Devils weren't horrible. If Ty Smith can rebound, that'll be good. Um, but he's obviously with a different team. So. I think they changed up the format for Platinum for this year, right? If I remember correctly. I just want to double check that before I say that. But I think it's like more cards... More cards per pack, which I am excited about. Like, yeah, it's 12 cards per pack, 12 packs per box. Um, so it's just like they condense it, which I like it. Yeah, that's a one problem with, uh, like, obviously not getting the rookie always kind of sucks. Um, oh, yeah, foodies and turf offs. But again, the thing with Platinum is that, like, if you've got a team that's got decent vets, like, there's always a chance. Um, Who do you end up with? You ended up with... I am just blind and can't... Oh, the Ducks, yeah. Um, yeah, they're definitely, I would say... You've got you've got hack and paw at least for like rookie autos and stuff and then Max Jones updates if we, you know, hit a home run, but yeah. So, all right. Here we go. Let's get started. There's box number. Yeah. Yeah, there's definitely some cool short print cards. Uh, sorry, one second, I just forgot to uh, make a spot for base cards because I normally forget to do that. And also we empty my garbage can, which is full of wrappers. There we go. Yeah, Calgary's... Uh, Calgary's one of those teams that every once in a while hit a sneaky auto though. So, it's platinum. It's weird. Man, I, like, it's going to be interesting to see the Sabres. I, like, the Sabres have a lot of people are just like, oh, like, Ottawa's going to be the team that bounces up the most. But it's like, don't sleep on the Sabres. By the way, we're ripping and stacking this. Because um, four cards per pack just takes a long time. Well, there's a good start. You got your base here ready. But yeah, we'll top load and sleeve regular, like, um, like regular rainbow rookies along the way. Uh, Habs, and it was another team in the middle. Um, who's beside Colorado alphabetically? Sharks. All right, here we go. Good luck. Starting off, Rainbow Carlson for the Capitals. Best in the world of Tavares for the Leafs. Bodan for Chicago on the rookie. McDavid on the retro. And uh, Aquamarine of Lazat to four ninety nine for the Kings. We'll top load. And, well, we'll sleeve up all the base parallels for now. Uh, Kaprizov again. It's got some little scuffs on it, but that's pretty normal for this. We'll sleeve up all the like numbered cards because those generally hold well. Uh, Sunset rookie of Joseph for the Penguins. Uh, we'll put that there. McLeod for the Oilers on the marquee rookie. Sorry, it's a little bit shambolic already. Uh, Ekblad for the Panthers on the rainbow. 
Where is Rainbows? There we go. Cousins on the Marquee Rookie. Uh, Korshkov on the Retro. Uh, Bowers on the Matte Pink. Uh, it's probably just a parallel. And, yeah. We'll see what the Matte Pinks. I, I feel like they could almost call this like Pink Steel almost with how they look. Uh, Byron for the Avs. Rainbow of Hall for the Sabres. Norris for the Senators. Uh, Retro Rainbow of Bodan for Chicago. Again, it's got some marks on it. I can't tell if that's the boards or on the card. Uh, Kratzov for the Rangers. Uh, another Sunset. Oh no, it's a Cosmic, sorry. Cosmic for Detroit of Dylan Larkin. Number to 85? No, 65. It's the uh, rookie autos that are 85, I think, then. Larkin for the Red Wings on the Cosmic. These are beautiful. 65. Nice one there. That's stand worthy enough. May not be the highest value card, but it's pretty. Uh, Foodie and Ty Smith. Uh, we'll throw the. It's Bodan. We'll throw him up there. Or right, we'll throw him with the McDavid. There we go. Alright. Make sure I didn't miss anything in that stack. No base, vari base variations are foiled, so that really helps. We'll just put base cards there, I guess. Here we go, next up. Oh yeah, Friends Who's is also with the Avs. Honestly, Sleeper. Big Sleeper, I think. This is a good box. I'm getting all the good rookies. But yeah, like anyone that could be the goalie for a Stanley Cup champion team is a Sleeper. Be interesting to see who gets the starts between him and Georgiev. I picked up George Yev in Fantasy Hockey and Matt Murray, so my goalies, you can tell what I'm going for. I'm going for the wins, and that's about it. All right, here we go. Second half of box one. Yeah, this stuff's fun to open. Just like It's just one of those classic staple sets, so. Well, there's a rookie auto. It's true for the Sharks. Probably one of the ones that you don't want to get, but no bubbling on it. That's good to see. True for the Sharks. First rookie auto. Francis for the Avs. Pedersen for the Canucks on the retro. Miller for the Rangers on the rookie. Delandrea on the rainbow rookie for the Stars. And Jason Robertson on the base rookie behind it for the Stars. Uh, we'll see you up. I think J-Rob's going to have a big year once he gets signed. Uh, Vasilevsky on the Sunset. Uh, there. Zamula for the Flyers. Uh, photo driven of Quinn Hughes for the Canucks. Strom for the Chicago. Uh, they haven't, I don't think they've officially named Tuck, but like he's going to be their captain. Vasilevsky for the Lightning. Hoaglander for the Canucks. Got a red prism coming up. Oh, this would have been huge at release. Lafreniere on the red prisms to 199 for the Rangers. I mean, it's still probably a decent card. Nice box one. Two pretty nice parallels. Laugh to 199 on the red prism. I think he could bounce back this year. Well, not bounce back, but like get a little bit more hype. So, low screen for the Leafs. Uh, Brian Rust on the rainbow. That's a really bright rainbow for the Penguins. Geeky for the Hurricanes. And Vrana for the Capitals on the retro. Box one. Pretty solid. Good base rookies. Laugh parallel. Cosmic. Of a like, decent player. Auto kind of sucked, but that's platinum for you. So. Here we go. Nice. Is my uh, fan in the background really annoying? I don't know if you can hear it whining or not, but. <laughs> okay, perfect. Uh, box number, I'm, it's not gonna matter because it's out of their, I think, date. So, 826. 
Okay, cool. I was just making sure. I've changed some stuff with my mic, so um, before it randomly would just like go really quiet and I tweak some settings and stuff and it hasn't done it in a while. So if you do hear my mic randomly go quiet, unless I'm like actually turning around, please let me know. Uh, just trying to make sure that our audio is good. But yeah. Uh, the laugh is number two, 199. Uh, Bill, you've missed Cosmic of Larkin and Laugh Red Prisms. Um, you had. Carolina. Carolina is one of those like sneaky ish teams in here. Yeah, I, I definitely had the settings to, tuned down a lot, so um, I've tweaked that. I just like having it full, full out there now. I had a noise gate on it as well, which probably didn't help because it was I had the air conditioning going for a while too, so. All right, here we go. How did I yellow come? Ooh, well, right there for Columbus. Calvin Turkoff on the Cosmic Rookie Autos. These are beautiful. Uh, these are to 85, right? Oh, 75, sorry. Got a little bit of a, you got a bonus auto on the back there. A little bit of a smudge from another one. But yeah, I definitely had that on for a little bit just because it was really loud in here. Again, not the like craziest value card, but really pretty card. So we highlight it. Belzeal for the Habs. Ent whistle for Chicago, foot for the Lightning, uh, Keith for Chicago, Del Andrea for the Stars, Sunset of Hedman for the Lightning, uh, Matthews for the Leafs, uh, Bellows for the Islanders, Gallagher for the Habs, Yul Levy for the Canucks, uh, Matthews for the Leafs on the photo driven, Bowers for the Avs. Next up, uh, oh, oh, nice. Ottinger on the yellow, yellow taxi, yellow track, sorry, to 249. That's another good parallel. Good player to get too. Yellow tracks of Ottinger to 249. Uh, Mark, you want to see the laugh? There you go, 199 on the laugh. Nice Ottinger. That's honestly like value-wise probably better than the Larkin and the Turkoff, but... Uh, Schmaltz for the Yotes on the Rainbow. McMichael for the Capitals. Bellows for the Islanders. Retro. Yeah. I think... Yeah, that's actually a good, like, a tough one. I think the... Um, like, the fact that they released the products so close together is a major downside to it. Um, I wish they would release one, like, I think the second year they did a lure, it was supposed to be a really early in the year release and Platinum was supposed to be later. And like, that's the approach I think they should take. Um, cause like, then you can get the updates and stuff in, but yeah, cause I think Platinum's got enough to be like its standalone set and like Allure, I think has the long-term potential, like staying power. But they just, they've been released way too closely together the past few, like, since Allure's been a, really a product. And I think that's really hurt Allure. Because I, I think, like, between the two products, honestly, like, I there's parts of Allure that I prefer. But, yeah. Here we go. Uh, Sagan for the stars on the rainbow. Francis for the Avs, Sweet Selections of Alexia for the Capitals, Calendar Miller for the Rangers, Olio Levy for the Canucks, uh, Tracks of Keith for Chicago, or not Tracks, sorry, Violet Pixels to $3.99. Uh, Robertson, here we sleeved up the J Rob before, we'll sleeve up this one as well. Sunset of Taze, uh, Zamula. Verana on the rainbow. 
Soderstrom on the retro, Palmieri on the pink steel, Hoaglander for the Canucks, or pink, the matte pink, sorry. Uh, Rainbow Rookie of Geeky for the Hurricanes. Rainbow Rookie of Geeky for the Hurricanes. Uh, retro Rainbow Rookie of Byron for the Avs. A little bit of like a hair there or something, but right there. I don't know if I can, yeah, there you can kind of see it. Rainbow of Byram. That's, again, nice card. Little Grim for the Leafs. Nice, Francis on the uh, yellow tracks to 249. So, honestly, two of the best goalies to get from this set. Same box, too, actually. We've had a lot of numbered cards in this box. Feels like Geeky for the Hurricanes. Uh, McLeod for the Oilers. And that's all she wrote on that box. Yep. All right. Box number three. So far, so good. Again, there's still lots of spots and breaks left on the site. Um, there's a filler break for the artifact, the second artifacts inner. The first, like the first inner, was solid, but nothing great. Uh, we should have a rookie auto in the second inner. Um, yeah. And so there's a filler break for that. It's two boxes each of MVP and from 21, 22, and 22, 23, and a box of series two retail. Uh, with two spots in uh, the artifacts break in that one. Um, so how that works is that you essentially get a mini break and then two people from that break will get a free spot in the, uh, whatchamacallit, the artifacts break. Um, there's still spots left in the actual artifacts break. Uh, spots left in Skybox Champions. And then obviously the Young Gun Hunt as well is still up there, so... Probably wait till those breaks fill before posting new ones at this point. So, um, any questions? Let me know though. Hopefully, uh, yeah, hopefully that's all kind of resolved. I know some people had questions about when the breaks would be happening and stuff like that. And so, I think we're actually down to 11 in the artifact break, but that's including the two in the filler breaks. So, like, it's kind of in this weird spot where the filler break has to fill now. Um, but yeah. Well, that's a good matte pink auto. A little scream for the Leafs. To 99. Nice little Lily for the Leafs. Pretty good one to get. Uh, there are about 10, like legitimately 10 different products. Um, that could be the next ones to drop. I wish I could say I was joking with that, but D Pietro for the Canucks. Um, we don't know. Vanchek for the Capitals, Krebs for Vegas, uh, Rainbow of Bennington, Stutzla for the Senators on the base rookie. There's some scuffs on and stuff on it. It's not perfect. But yeah, it could be like anything from Platinum to Team Canada Juniors to Allure to Ice to SPX, SP Game Used. Um, there's, a, there's a long, long list. Sunset of uh, Krug for the Blues. Marchand for the Bruins on the best in the world. Harley for the Stars. Connecting for the Flyers. Turkoff for Columbus. Liljegrin on the Sweet Selections for the Leafs. Mitchell for Chicago. Arctic Freeze of Zamula for the Flyers to 99. Uh, got a nice little line down the back there. I don't, I honestly don't know if Upper Deck will do anything about it. So the front of the card is perfectly fine. The back of the card, fortunately, has that. This was, I forgot what box. I think it was the four six nine one. Yeah, or six four nine. Sorry. I don't know if they'll do anything about it, but just like as a heads up, because it is an older, older product, so. That goes up there. Uh, Kratzoff on the Rainbow Rookie. 
Ingram for the Predators. Lorentz on the Retro for the Hurricanes. But yeah, there's a lot of different products that it could be in. It's just kind of waiting for um, waiting for one of them to drop at this point. I mean, there's a non-zero chance that Series 1 in November will be the next product. I doubt it, but... Fingers crossed, at least, because I'd like to see, you know, we'd all like to see new products. Obviously, we just had Artifacts last week, so it kind of, like, it feels like Artifacts is a little cooler than normal just because it's later in the year and you don't have the, like, speculation over the uh, Rookie Redemption. So, Lance Gog for the Avs, Laugh for the Rangers on the Rookie, and this one has the usual, like, some scratch marks on it. Nothing, like, too new, so... Photo driven of Kopitar for the Kings, Anderson for the Kings, Angelo for the Penguins. Ooh! Pond hockey of Mr. McDavid. It's like. I thought the pond hockey had a <laughs> bigger background, but that's a huge hit. That's actually like a huge hit. Pond hockey of McDavid. That is massive for the Oilers. Hmm. Non-numbered, but super, super short print. Um, probably going to end up being the hit of the break. Might end up being one of our best hits of the month. So McDavid Pond Hockey. Well, the Larkin goes. Um, the Little Green gets bumped over. I mean, like, yeah, that's... I'd say that'd be, like, hit of the break. Um, David on hockey. Yeah, pretty, uh, okay. So like last one sold for like 70, one sold for 150, somewhere's in there. Still pretty, pretty nice card. You'll have it for the Canucks, but really, really rare. I think that's the first pond hockey we've ever opened actually. Uh, Tavares for the Leafs, Bowers for the Avs. Ty Smith on the rainbow for the Devils. Mr. Smith. Uh, Jack Hughes. And Jamie Ben. And Joseph for the Penguins. What are yellow tracks coming up? Stamkos for the Bolts on the refractor. Uh, Ottinger on the retro rainbow for the Stars. Nice one there. Uh, Marky Rookie of Hagel. Forgot Hughes in this. Uh, Taylor Hall for the Sabres. To 249. Uh, Kaliev, this one's really, really scratched up. Yeah, I'm shocked. I mean, again, it could just depend on the right buyer at the right time. Krebs for Vegas, because like I, I would, I would have said the same thing that it would have been a little bit more. Okay, let me just get the base out of the way here. But yeah, it's still a really nice card. Yeah, nice McDavid pond hockey though. Again, another solid box. Like a, one of the better, I'd say one of the better rookie autos to actually get. Cause like you could get some really bad ones and like hitting obviously like a good defenseman on the Leafs. It's nice as long as he can stay healthy. Box number is 362. Yeah, shocked that the McDavid's that low, but again, it's not like a clear set 
thing. So but yeah, they're super short print, super hard to pull. Again, we've opened up a lot of this and we've maybe pulled like one or two other ones. So always cool when you get like a really short print card. The laugh might honestly outsell it. Let me check. Uh, no, it's about the same. It's well, it's yeah, it's a little bit lower, but it's close. It's close to what I thought. Like I thought the McDavid pond hockey would actually be way up there. All right, here we go. We have a red auto here. Foodie for Columbus on the red rainbow auto. Busy, have you hit three out of the four autos? Yep, I think so. Bellows for the Islanders. Pareko for the Blues. Hoaglander for the Canucks. Rene for the Predators on the rainbow. Matthews for the Leafs on the uh, sunset. Lilshagram for the Leafs. Foodie for Columbus. Geeky for the Hurricanes. Shifley for the Jets. McMichael for the Capitals. Crosby for the Penguins on the best in the world. Belzeal for the Habs. Well, that's a good Arctic Freeze to 99. Mr. Kale McCarr. Numbered 63 of 99. What up? What a break. Like, what a half case. We're hitting, not only are we hitting parallels, we're hitting the right parallels. Yeah, you're having an insane break, because that one's yours too. Uh, McDavid on the rainbow for the Oilers. Honestly, like, that's a half decent card as well. Foot for the Lightning. Panarin for the Rangers, still Andrea for the Stars. I don't know, the Macaro to 99. Um, Macaro, 20, 20, 21. Platinum out of 99. Yeah, same thing, like another $50 card, something like that. It's got lots of like really, like, really solid stuff. Our base autos haven't been the best, but I'm not, I mean, again, we've had our red rainbow. We've had a two out of 99 or less, so can't even complain too much there. And like, Liljegren's not a bad name. Foodie's not the worst. Turkov, I mean, yeah. True, I mean, yeah. But. Oh, nice. Yeah, Black Diamond, like, Black Diamond is like sometimes some of the cards that come out of there are just beautiful. But yeah, when you hit when you hit that like big card for someone, it's always like it's so it's such a cool feeling. The most nerve wracking thing I've ever had with the break was that Lemieux Gretzky dual auto from the cup because like one of the people was getting shut out in the break. I'm pretty sure, and then the other person was getting uh getting that card. And like, that's a big swing. Reduke for Vegas, Malcolm for the Penguins on the matte pink. Uh, Carlson for the Sharks on the rainbow. Francis for the Avs. Larkin on the rainbow. Miller for the Rangers. Schmaltz for the Yotes. Well, I'll put that one there. It's a red prism. Ooh. Peron decided to jump ship. Uh, Kachuk, Robertson, this one seems a little cleaner. No, it's still scratched up, but. Uh, Rainbows of Bodan. Let me just leave up the schmaltz at this point. 
Yeah, and it's like it's not at the point where you can be like, hey, do you guys want to split this? Um, Ajo for the Hurricanes, the Mula for the Flyers, Cube Lennox for uh, Columbus, Anders Lee on the Aquamarine to four ninety nine for the Islanders. Byron for the Avs. Uh, you'll love you on the Sunset Rookie for the Canucks. I don't know why I'm sleeping that up, but whatever. And Rainbow of Krug for the Blues with a Norris for the Senders in the back. Like, there's probably eventually going to be some random card that we pulled that, like, has to get random off that's, like, big, big, big money card. And it's like, oh, dear. Like, it'd be one where it's like, I'm not even going to do the random. I'm going to email both of you and see what you guys want to do with the card. Well, what you two want to do with the card. Because, like, that's one that you could legitimately be like, hey, I will buy you out of that. Or something like that. So. so I'm just uh, shrinking down the rookies and parallels before they overflow. Box number, but yeah, those are the nerve wracking moments. Our actual biggest pull has to be the um, the Kaprizov horizontal RPA from Premier. Like it has to be that. I can't think of anything else that's actually bigger. Uh, I guess the Kaprizov... No, because the Kaprizov Young Guns exclusives aren't going to be up there. our autos on this half i want to see a golden treasure we've had one of those types of breaks oh well sweet selections rainbow auto no number eight this guy's pretty good though jason robertson that uh expires in a year jason robertson sweet selections rookie auto for the stars why not what a case holy cow lily you have to take a back seat It's not the true rookie auto, but you take it, right? Like, it's one of those just like, hey, it may not be the number one card that you want, but, like, you're never upset. Bowers for the Avs, Gensel for the Penguins, McMichael for the Capitals, uh, Rainbow Rookie of Mr. Yol Levy. Glad I got two things of sleeves. Thought I'd need them, and it turns out I did. Quinn Hughes for the Canucks. Belzeal for the Habs. Uh, Patterson for the Canucks. Foot for the Lightning. Harley for the Stars. Kalia for the Kings. Best in the World of Shifley for the Jets. Mr. Laugh for the Rangers. That seems kind of cleanish. Violet Pixels of Kershaw for Chicago. That's more of a violent pixels to three ninety nine. That one there, Mikey Anderson for the Kings, Pavelski for the Stars on the Rainbow, Yol Levy for the Canucks, then the Yol Levy box, Hackenpaw for the Ducks. Not a there. Let me uh, get more sleep built. I love it. I love when I have to get more sleeves out. 
Means the break's going good. Yeah, I'd say one thing that's gonna, yeah, like awesome inner and we're not, we're four and a half boxes in. Like if the inner ended with like three duds of a boxes, it'd be a great inner. But yeah, uh, I think still like the rainbow rookies are still gonna go up a little bit from platinum over time. I think those are gonna slowly start creeping up more and more. Um, especially maybe the autographs, but yeah. It'll be interesting to see how 2122 Platinum does. I'm looking forward to it because I, I like I honestly like the format of that better. Uh, the 20 pack format, like it's weird because it makes packs more affordable, but I just don't think like you know, it also makes them a little bit more risky in a certain sense too. Uh Svetch for the Hurricanes on the rainbow. Uh, Pedersen for the Canucks. It's got that weird like foiling issue that sometimes they get. Geeky for the Habs. Alexia for the Capitals. Francis for the Avs. Tammy Stutzla on the Sunset Rookie for the Senators. There we go. That's a cool parallel. We'll put that in there. Miller for the Rangers. Subban on the Rainbow. Robertson for the Stars. There we go. Besser for the Canucks. Man, Yolevi. We literally have the Yol the Yolevi rainbow in this box. Gaudreau for the Flames. Delandrea for the Stars. Oh, God. I'm going to mess up Gaudreau next year a lot. Gensel for the Penguins. Uh, Bellows for the Islanders. McLeod for the Oilers on the yellow uh, tracks. The 249. 128 of 249. Lots of rookie uh, parallels, which you love to see. Hoaglander. Deneau and Liljegren. Yep. Deneau and Lily. Yeah, that box we had... Uh, what your levies did we get there? We got the Sunset, the base, and the matte pink. Or the rainbow and the base, yeah. All right. Next box. Uh, six, eight, nine on the numbers. What's going to be hiding in this box? Who's our auto going to be? I mean, honestly, like, a vet auto would be cool, but, eh. I, again, I would love to see a Golden Treasures, but given uh, how hot this inner has been. I mean, then again, given how hot this inner has been, it could be this inner, you know? It's one of those things. Uh, Boquist for the Devils on the update autograph. One of my biggest complaints about Platinum is that, and hopefully they fix it for this year, is that update autos count as your auto hit. I am not a big fan of that. Kratzoff for the Rangers. Belzeal for the Habs. Van Riemsdyk for the Flyers on the Rainbow. Ty Smith for the Devils. McKinnon. For the Avs on the Sunset, Bodan for Chicago, Burns for the Sharks, Caprizov for the Wild, that one's a little cleaner. Uh, Bodan, uh, short print, Easter egg insert of Kane for Chicago. Golden Treasures are the one of one.
Uh, Bodan for Chicago. Lots of Chicago. Holy cow. Sudmula for the Flyers. Matthews on the yellow tracks for the Leafs. That's a solid one. 47. Of 249. Nothing wrong with the little Austin Matthews numbered card. There we go. Byron for the Avs. Bowers for the Avs on the rainbow. But yeah, the golden treasures are the one of ones. They're, again, obviously extremely tough to pull. Bowers for the Avs. Norris for the Senators. All good. Yeah, it's been a really solid inner. Uh, you know, auto there was not great, but... Like, you could technically do worse than Boquist, but, like, I'd just rather get the current year's autograph, I think, at that point, so. There's Brad, on the other hand. That's a few years old, though. I'd love to see a golden treasures. I've I've actually never pulled one, and not that I expect to, but I pulled a super fractor auto before. But so like it's got that similar vibe to it, right? But uh, nurse for the Oilers on the rainbow, foodie for the Blue Jackets, O'Reilly for the Blues, Lindstrom for the Red Wings, Nick Michael for the Capitals, Radulov on the Aqua Marine to four ninety nine for the Stars, one seven eight of four nine nine. Fox for the Rangers on the Sunset. Cout for the Avs. Rainbow Rookie of McMichael for the Capitals. I think this is our first time with this rookie crop, actually. Romanov for the Habs. Byron for the Avs. Zuccarello on the matte pink for the Wild. Nelson on the Rainbow for the Islanders. McLeod for the Oilers. Besser on the Retro Rainbow for the Canucks. Cousins for the um, Sabres. Hagel for Chicago on the red prisms to 199. You get another solid one, like solid NHLer on a good team. Has potential. O'Reilly and Coughlin. O'Reilly for the Blues, Coughlin for Vegas. That was, I'd say, probably our weakest box. I would say. Had our best rainbow rookie. Had a nice parallel with the Matthews. The auto is kind of meh. Um, yeah, I'd say that was our weakest box. Double O six on the box numbers. There we go. Alright, let's see something numbered below 50 or below. That's our goal for the rest of this break. We got two boxes to do. An orange checkers, uh, what should I call it? Golden surge, one of those would be nice. We can hope. Uh, for you specifically, uh, were you here for, were you here for that? Oh yeah, then you definitely missed this. Yeah, sweet selections, rainbow auto of, uh, Robertson. Um, McCarta 99. Yeah. It's just been, it's been, last box was our worst box. Um, I'd say by far. But like, still been solid. We got a Matthews to 249. Um, what else? Uh, McLeod numbered card, Astute's a sunset. So. That might be a golden surge. All right, well, that's our auto gonna be because it's in the same spot every time. 
Here we go. Shemilevsky on the Rainbow Rookie Auto for the Sharks. Not bad. Honestly, like, probably not the worst. But I don't know where he stands in Sharks line because they just went through a bunch of changes. So, could do worse. Could do worse. Kaliev. Pavelski. Laugh. For the Rangers. Debrinkat for Chicago. Anderson for the Kings. Lannis Gog for uh, Colorado. Yolevi for the Canucks. Filardi for the Kings. Sweet selections. Burdine for the Jets on the Retro Rookie. Panarin for the Rangers on the Best in the World. Harley for the Stars. Uh, there we go. There's our uh, Golden Treasures, right? Or Seismic Gold, sorry. Uh, not Golden Treasures. Uh, to 50 of Kadri for the Avs. Kadri to 50 for the Avs. Not bad. And Busy, you are... You are cleaning up. Joseph for the Penguins. To be fair, you do have four spots in the break, but you are cleaning up still. Uh, McKinnon for the Avs. That's just a regular rainbow. Hegel for Chicago. Uh, Burns for the Sharks. You got, what, four autos? Forgot the Sharks are like that. Deep team, right? Because you got one, two, three. Yeah, you got four autos. Five, six. Wait, am I? Oh, no, I'm not, because there's five there. Remember in Vegas in one of our breaks hit like two cosmic autos and a base auto, and it was like, it's too bad none of them are Krebs, but like, it's still pretty crazy. Sharks, Sharks have actually done pretty well in the Platinum Breaks now that I'm remembering it. Columbus, obviously, is Columbus. It's one of those things, like, they sure they might not be, like, the most valuable rookie autos, but, like, you know, if you were to spend the money on a box, you'd, that'd be your auto. Uh, Zamula for the Flyers. I really like him today, too. Him and, him and Yolevi. I'm just going to sleep with the McKinnon quickly. I don't think it's a major card, but... I think the rainbows have died down a little bit. Shifley on the best in the world. Delandrea for the stars. Uh, Delandrea for the stars. Gibson for the ducks to four ninety nine on the aquamarine. Yeah, Chicago's been actually somewhat quiet. Bellows for the Islanders. Sunset rookie of Laugh for the Rangers. We have just hit, like, good cards and good parallels today, for the most part. Outside of autos, but... Hoaglander for the Canucks. Connor for the Jets. The Little Green for the Leafs. Makar on the Retro. Shifley on the Matte Pink. Bowers for the Avs. Ben on the Rainbow. McMichael for the Capitals on the Rookie. Mark Stone on the Retro Rainbow. Pelzeal for the Habs. Lorenz on the Arctic Freeze Rookie for the Hurricanes. 99. 97 of 99. Yeah, I'll go back through and make sure that, like, no one got beat really bad by the break, but Hegel and Foot, it's platinum, like, for the most part, everyone should have stuff. All right, final box. I mean, hey, pretty good stuff. Lots of numbered rookies, which is what you open this stuff for anyways. So, I guess we have one. We've had the one good auto. You could argue Shemilevsky's okay. Um, be nice to get a big auto or a low numbered card here. Well, let's put that pack over there. Here we go. What do you do? Wait, actually it needs to go here. That's probably going to be the auto.
it's been that same spot the whole case, so doubt it changes. Again, we got our out of 50 or less. It'd be, let's go lower, out of 25 or less. See some orange. Remember back in the day, I think we pulled the Fox Seismic Gold. Um, actually, I think that was from this. Oh no, it, yeah, it might have been from this actually. Um, yeah. Here we go. Auto obviously won't be on top. Well, is your grain on the rainbow for the Leafs? Again, not the worst one. Take him over Zamula, that's for sure. Barkov for the Panthers. Kalia for the Kings. Hurdle for the Sharks. Kopitar for the Kings on the Aquamarine. $4.99. Laugh for the Rangers. Oop. Sorry. Let's leave that. Uh, Hagel on the Sunset for Chicago. Rainbow of Connecting for the Flyers, Anderson for the Kings, Sagan for the Stars, Matt Pink of Nelson, Stutzla Base, Jimmy Base, Stepan on the Rainbow, Harley for the Stars, Retro Rainbow of Belzeal for the Habs, Joseph for the Penguins. Ooh, we got the blue, the retro blue of Besser for the Canucks to 149. Cool card. Yeah, sometimes it's like with some teams, it's just like, oh, just give me something. But yeah, again, I'll make sure no one got like beat really bad. Um, try and be conscious of that just because, you know, it's not the best feeling. So I want to see something sick here. I want to see something sick. Give me something low numbered. Something high numbered. I don't, or high numbered, but a good rookie. Something really cool. Cause it's been a pretty epic break. You know, you kind of want to finish it off in an epic style, right? So here we go. Let's get the base cards out of the way. Autograph should be at the bottom. Oh, it's not a. Really, the autograph's not, so one time it's the top on this side. Well, it's geeky for the Hurricanes. I was trying to keep it suspenseful and save it for last, but nope, it's this time it's on the other side. Of course. Geeky for the Hurricanes. Mitchell for Chicago. Hishier for the Devils. Uh, Ingram for the Predators. Rainbow of Fiala for the Wild. Di Pietro for the Canucks. Sunset of Parisi for the Wild. Krebs for Vegas. Geeky for the Hurricanes. Norris for the Senators. McDavid on the best in the world for the Oilers. Broberg for the Oilers. Arctic Freeze of Sidney Crosby. Sure, why not? Give us another low numbered, like high end hit. Crosby to 99 for the Penguins. This has been a pretty crazy case. Pretty crazy case. Uh, Alexia for the Capitals. Honestly, Rask for the Bruins. The Lozogrins have enough time in the spotlight. It can get bumped out for now. Turkoff. Patrick Kane. And it is a Turkoff that's saved for the end with the haggle behind it. So that is the break. Uh, let me go ahead and uh, double check, make sure I didn't miss anything, and then we'll do a recap. Don't think I did, though. Uh, I mean, hey. If you had the right team in this break, you're laughing. Um, yeah, let's go through a recap here. Let's start off with the... I want to order these a little bit nicer. Um, yellow tracks, that. That'll be in the top, probably top five or so. so um, any of these, like, major worthy? Ah, those can both be, like, notables. Something like this. Sure. All right, 
Here we go, recap time. So some of our autos, Morgan Geeky, uh, Rainbow Auto, Shmolevsky for the Sharks, Bokris on the update, Foodie on the Red Rainbow, Turkov 275 on the Cosmic, and True for the Sharks. Uh, some of our low numbered rookies, Laurent for the Hurricanes, 299 on the Arctic Freeze, Kadri on the Seismic Gold, 250 for the Avs. It's not a rookie, but it's a little solid pull. Uh, Zamula for the Flyers. Again, this one's got the weird like line through it on the Arctic Freeze. Uh, some other like big name rookies and cool parallels. We got Olaf and Stutzel on the Sunsets. Uh, we got McLeod, Francouz, and Unders on the Yellow Tracks at 249. Pretty solid trio there. Hegel on the uh, Red Prism. 199 Matthews on the yellow tracks at 249. Uh, good vet base of Larkin 265. And then probably our best our best live auto is the Lilja Green Matte Pink to 99. Um, and then yeah, top five. Um, I guess we start with the Makar. Arctic Freeze to 99. Um, Crosby. Next up, Arctic Freeze to 99. Uh, Laugh. Next up, Red Prism to 199. Nice Red Prism rookie there. Uh, second, I'd say this could end up being the most valuable card of the break, but Robertson, uh, Sweet Selections, Rainbow Auto. These are pretty tough to pull for the stars. And hit of the break, we're going to call the McDavid Pond Hockey the hit of the break. Just super short print card, cool parallel. Really not much more to be said, but yeah. Um, huh, I just noticed that, that this has like ink on the back of it, so. Hmm, that's weird. All right, um, that is the break. Yeah, I was honestly kind of shocked there wasn't like an emerald or like uh, orange checkers or something, but like <laughs> pretty crazy case nonetheless. Uh, lots of good stuff. That is group break number uh, two, or sorry, 322.